YouTube, welcome to my channel. Hey folks, remember to like, subscribe, and comment because we are bringing the tea over here. And remember, it's always piping hot. So let's get right into it. People are crawling out of the cracks in the wood to throw their support behind Keisha Knight Pulliam's ex-husband, Ed Hartwell. Now, legal documents filed in court say that Keisha does not want Ed Hartwell near their two-month-old daughter, Ella. Keisha claims that Hartwell plotted to trigger a miscarriage during her pregnancy, and of course, Hartwell denies that claim. Now, new documents were actually filed by Ed Hartwell seeking joint custody of baby Ella, and his ex-wife, Lisa Wu, wrote a letter on his behalf to the court saying that he's a great dad. She said she never has to worry about her child being with his dad and that he will do everything within his power to love, protect, and provide for EJ while she's not around. In the letter, she assures the, the course that he will put baby Ella first and put her best interests first. Now, in 2003, we're going back, y'all. Lisa Wu actually lost custody of her eldest sons by her then ex-husband, Keith Sweat. Now, the judge in that case stated that Lisa had a history of spending money on herself excessively rather than providing for the children. Of course, her maturity and judgment in that in that particular case were in question and that was one of the many reasons that she lost custody and if you guys remember it was alleged that Keith Sweat was actually uh, physically abusive to her so it was kind of confusing as to why she lost custody of course you know these these stars can get these great lawyers and you know once you got a good lawyer you know the other person is pretty much you know out of luck now wasn't there an accusation that Lisa Wu had an affair with Cynthia Bailey's husband, Peter Thomas, from Housewives of Atlanta? I remember that back in like 2015, 2014. Look, folks, no shade, but for real, Ed, you might want to find another character witness. Just saying. Go ahead and comment, like, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye.